Uh, Sally, uh, you say that the storm, as we all said, didn't last terribly long, but you recorded more than a hundred lightning strikes from it today, right? It packed quite a punch, Cor. If anyone was outside or, you know, anywhere, pretty much around the Portland metro area, you heard the thunder. Now, I am going to pause this radar here. You can see at 1031 this morning, that's when things started to blossom. Notice near Malala here, we're going to loop that. There's a quick moving line of thunderstorms pushed up from the south to the north. Uh, the peak activity was between about 11 and noon. We recorded more than 100 lightning strikes, small hail reported, and downpours of rain. This is the current radar imagery. So you can see we have really quieted things down west of the Cascades, but that's not true east of the mountains. We've got very heavy rain and some lightning and thunder over the Dalles right now. That's all pushing north. The Tri-Cities getting hammered, and then John Day and Baker City hearing thunder this afternoon as well. Now, I'm going to zoom in on Seattle because the 49ers and the Seahawks are playing tonight. So it looks like a lot of fireworks at CenturyLink Field in Seattle. Uh, hopefully you can maybe watch that on TV tonight. Coming up in your main forecast, I have got the one warm day this week. There's only one of them. A lot of 60s on the seven day. I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, Sally, thanks very much.